Hey guys, this is Dr. Hub. In case you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe for updates. Compound versus the cancellous bone. Compact and cancellous bone. So first, let's look at the compact. So compact the location is in the outer cortex. And what about the lamella? The lamella it is arranged to form the Haversian canal. So it forms the Haversian system. Then we look at the BM that is the bone marrow. The bone marrow is nothing but in compact bone it is yellow. So bone marrow is yellow and what it does is it stores fat. Bone marrow is yellow, it stores fat and this is after the puberty. So it stores fat after the puberty. Then it is red before puberty. So it is yellow as it stores after puberty and it is red. So it is red. When is it red? It is red before. So it is before the puberty. Now let's look at the nature. So when you look at the nature, it is hard and ivory like. So the compact bone will be hard as well as it will be ivory like. Next we look at the cancellous bone. So in terms of the cancellous bone, it is the spongy, spongy bone. So where is it located? The cancellous of the spongy bone is located in the inner medulla. So it is present in the inner medulla. Then what about the lamella? So in terms of the lamella, it is arranged in a meshwork. It is arranged as the meshwork. And so the Haversian system are absent. So cancellous bone does not have the Haversian system. Then when you look at the BM, there is a bone marrow. It is red. Red. That is it produces the RBCs. And also the granular series of WBC on the platelets. So the granular series of the WBC as well as the platelets. Now, what is the nature of this cancellous bone? The nature of the cancellous bone is nothing but it is spongy. To learn and grow daily like this, please do subscribe.